Good morning, everybody. Just want uh, everybody to know that uh, Hector and I have been uh, doing a little work. We put the uh, logistic uh, plan on uh, Blue Beams. So if you open his file in Blue Beams, not in Acrobat Adobe or anything else, just on Blue Beam, you're going to see some enhancement that uh, we did to the uh, drawing. So uh, I'm just going to uh, bring you really quick. So we made some changes. Uh, Hector told me to delete the old projects and also to add some of the new projects, as you could see there. Uh, also, you could see on the drawing that uh, uh, some little icons been added. Uh, these are some captures, video, uh, I mean, not video, uh, photo captures that we added. Uh, you could see there's a camera here and it shows the angle where the picture was taken. Another picture here showing the angle, another one here another one here and so forth and over here uh this is a 3d camera that i have i, I want to see if i start taking some of the uh, uh construction pictures on three dimensional so i could share it with you guys so when you get this drawing and you open it with blue beams uh you could do the following you could open it uh review it make sure that all the information is accurate and that you agree upon it and you could click on this picture these pictures are some of the pictures that i taken of the construction of the cafeteria costa i apologize for sticking my nose on your project but i think this project is coming along very nice so i i've been going up to the bsp roof as you can see there and taking a picture from this angle so if you click on the icon of the capture you're going to see the picture. There is a picture of the uh, crane installing uh, some of the steel work. So uh, it shows pretty much everything. You could zoom in, you could, you know, go left and right. Uh, it's a high quality picture that is embedded in the, in the blue bean drawing. Uh, I also took a picture from this roof over here. So if you click on this, this, this is an updated, this is like a month away from when the first one this one has the uh already all the steel and it also has the steel for uh the roof right before the concrete is poured uh, i also took a picture from the ground level <clears throat> just to show where the steel was going up so thanks for that project for uh you know it's a very nice project like i say it's a project that's visible all the other projects we're doing inside nobody sees the uh, Cafeteria projects are very visible. Uh, I'm also, like I said, going to be taking a three-dimensional picture. This is an old picture that I took uh, way back when uh, we were on the COVID. For, uh, I mean, I'm sorry, not Farouk. Uh, Raul asked me to take some three-dimensional pictures so we could make a, a on-site site visit. So I took, I don't know, maybe 20 or 30. This is just one of them. Uh, so... Uh, the beauty of the three-dimensional picture is that you are in control. By using blue beans, you could actually rotate the picture and you could see a specific area that you want. So there's no need to go into a room and take 200 pictures to show all the angles. You could just take one picture with this camera and it shows you everything. I'm sorry if I'm getting you guys dizzy. So that what a three-dimensional picture is going to look like and uh, it's very well illustrated on the uh, blue beam capture features. Uh, another picture uh, that I want to share with you guys is this one here. This is showing the loading dock. There's quite a bit of work going on the loading dock and uh, I just wanted to show you so uh, everybody knows. So on the loading dock there's going to be a, a new air exhaust. It's quite big. I think it's a hundred and someone inches by like 20 inches is going to be placed in here. So we're, uh, you know, disturbing Mr. Richard Bentley there and his staff so we could uh, run the duct inside. Also on this platform here, uh, there is some coordination that's going to have to be done. Uh, 14 1000 is going to be installing a handful of condensing unit. These condensing units are going to be used to uh, cool down the uh, sub-basement level switch gear, the uh, new uh, electrical closet in the three ATS and also as well as the uh, new P gear. Uh, this particular area over here is being used. Uh, it's one of the projects of Alicia, my apologies. I don't know the project uh, number nor name, 
but uh, there's also going to be some condensing units for another project uh, uh, later to be uh, named. So that's pretty much it, you know. So if you click on one of these items, you will see pictures. So I think that will enhance it. So if anybody has any great picture they would like to share on the logistic, uh, send it to uh, my colleague there, <clears throat> Hector. He will embed it in the picture, and uh, if he has any, you know, difficulties, I will help him out. Uh, I'm just being an extra hand here. I'm not trying to, you know, uh, take over anything. But uh, when you guys review this, uh, I'll be in the Dominican Republic, probably holding a nice cold beer and thinking of all you guys. So uh, see you guys soon. See you in a week. Bye-bye.